the generator saying, yummy, full synthetic, my daddy loves me. The air filters are good. Those at every 200 hours, I'd say. I'll take a look at the manual, but I looked at it last time and there was nothing. I guess it depends on your environment where you're running the beast. Okay. That one's done, guys. That one's done. Now this one should be drained. Lift it up and see what we got. Oh, that one wasn't drained. here guys hard to avoid it guys very difficult to avoid that a little bit of debris okay so we need to just be down here in the middle somewhere and we got it Mm, that's very close. That's, that's about, if I would have to put a guess on it, that's 14 fluid ounces right there. Let's see what it looks like when we tip it back. It's close. See, it's getting there, guys. Yeah, I guess it's more than 14. It's closer to a half a quart. Just a little spill. I would. I thought I had this measured at about 14. I don't think these marks on this container are very accurate either, to be honest with you. That should do it right there. Another good thing about having good another good thing about having two generators say one of them takes a 
shit on you or something, you know what I'm saying, where it won't start or whatever. It's good to have that other one to back it up. Does that make sense, gentlemen? The rubber seal was on there. I can see it. Rubber seal. The oil's all the way up to the, the threads there, the top thread. So that's where it, you, that's full. stuff I mean it's very possible that these may have to go in the car sometime sometimes so you want to try to keep them clean clean up any spillage as best you can I'll dump that oil away too. 